Guys, what's up? Welcome back. Today we're talking about Blue Protocol. This may be the next huge, if not best, MMORPG of all time. Real quick, let's cover everything we know about Blue Protocol, when to look forward to it, and why this is going to completely change gaming forever. Blue Protocol is an anime MMORPG that has been in the works for quite a while. I really wish there was a release date right now, but we just don't know yet. The earliest we might get this game might be sometime in 2023. It's being created by Bandai. Besides the critically acclaimed monumental success that is Elden Ring, we have a ton of other games that they've made. Tekken, The Amazing Soul Calibur, Xenosaga, the list goes on and on and on. Long story short, they know what they're doing. This game is going to be completely free to play based on other games in the past. It will definitely have a cash shop, some founder pack, stuff like that. But it's going to be a completely free MMORPG that is anime inspired. Bandai has said that they do not want to make this game pay to win at all. Saying that most of the items in the cash shop are going to be completely for cosmetics only. Hopefully they keep up that promise. Regardless, it does seem that their intent is in the right place so far. The gameplay for Blue Protocol is absolutely fluid. As you're leveling up, you'll get better and better skills. New perks, dungeons. I mean, this is your MMORPG. MMORPG. The combat system is incredibly fast paced. The game is huge and there's no tap targeting. You don't have to target every single mob. You're just constantly using all your skills directly ahead of you. Now let me tell you why Blue Protocol is going to be so successful. MMORPGs were among the first types of games that came out on the internet. Anybody else remember MUDs when you had to type in text to play? There's just always been something about that feeling of going back in time, grabbing those arrows and swords, using magic, going on adventures, and the ever so addicting experience of just getting loot, killing monsters, and leveling up. Something about this experience is simply classic. The ability to just hardcore pour yourself into a video game endlessly at times to where nothing else seems to matter. Over time, MMORPGs have changed and grown dramatically. Now, part of why I believe Blue Protocol is going to be so incredibly successful is because it incorporates the anime aspect, but in the perfect MMO type experience. Putting video games aside, there's something about anime that we all love as well. Scientifically, the color of bright anime have actually been proven to induce happiness into individuals. The bright colors, the cool outfits, regardless of whether you're a huge anime fan or not, there's simply no denying that anime is a huge part of culture. Anime has, over the years, has had a profound impact on video games. The imagination that can be captured through anime and the expansive experience seems to, for whatever reason, entwine perfectly with what an MMORPG is all about. There's been more and more anime-based MMOs coming out over the years and MMO anime. What exactly is it that makes these two forms match together so well? I can't really say. But what I can firmly say is whether it's Blue Protocol or another MMO, the next big MMORPG that's going to dominate everything will be anime-styled. And when I say massive, I mean games like World of Warcraft, Final Fantasy XIV. I'm predicting that games like this, especially with the advent of AR, VR, the radical expansion and domination of video games on mobile in general, there will be a game eventually that makes Fortnite, World of Warcraft, Final Fantasy, all of these games look like absolutely child's play when it comes to player numbers. And I'm telling you guys, Blue Protocol is it. I'm talking about a future where everybody plays. Like in Sword Art Online or Ready Player One, there will be a game like that. Now, why haven't we seen this already? Here is Genshin Impact, for example. Why hasn't this taken over? I'll tell you why, because there's flaws in games like Genshin Impact, where they have a gotcha-based system. Genshin Impact could have been the Blue Protocol. And yeah, it's a great game, but it's missing the key elements of an MMORPG. Genshin Impact, if it was just a different type of game, could have been this next game that I'm talking about. Except for the MMO experience. You don't have the ability to create your own character, dress them up, increase your own armor, and go explore in a vast world. Genshin Impact was so close. It has the colors, the combat, the MMORPG almost kind of experience, but it fell short where Blue Protocol will not. I want a game where I can create my own character. I want that MMORPG experience that so many others have, and whether we know it or not, we do want it in an anime style. It's the bold lines, the colors, the flashiness, that makes anime and anime games so incredible. You don't have to like anime to enjoy an anime video game. Blue Protocol combines all the aspects of all the best MMOs out there together into one beautiful package. For example, the speed and movement of simply moving around in World of Warcraft is what makes WoW's PvP so incredibly immersive and addicting to this day. And you get that same fluid movement from Blue Protocol. It takes the beautiful art of story making and putting it into a game and just absolutely throws 
throwing you into that lore and enthralling you with its story, just like games like Final Fantasy XIV. But where games like Genshin Impact fail, Blue Protocol will succeed because it's an actual MMO. You can explore the entire world, you can level up your skills, you can get gear upgrades, you can move fast, you can design your character how you want. There is no gotcha based system, and if that wasn't enough, it's for free. Bandai has taken every good thing about every other great MMORPG out there, learned from them, studied them, and incorporated those things into Blue Protocol. But with reviews coming in already being absolutely spectacular, from beta testers, footage, and reviews, I can confidently say that in the end, everything I've spoken about today points to Blue Protocol not only being the best MMORPG possibly of all time, but possibly the biggest video game Game. This game will take the world by storm and I cannot wait to play it. Guys, this is going to be the game. Now, I know I'm getting ahead of myself, but one thing is for sure, regardless of what you think about anime or whether you're even into MMORPGs at all, Blue Protocol is the game to watch out for. Guys, I'll be honest, I've never been more excited about any other game out there ever, all time, period. Oof. Thank you so much for hanging out with me guys today. I really appreciate it. Let me know down below if you're excited as well. But if you're interested, definitely smash that subscribe button. As soon as we get more information on this game, I'm going to be linking it everywhere. And I'll definitely be pushing out a lot more blue protocol as the game gets closer. Y'all have a fantastic rest of your week. And don't forget to grind harder, baby. Let's go.